Okay, Jill and Chris are in the jungle. They find themselves in a pit. The ratio of spiders to snakes in the pit is 15 to 8. 70% of the spiders are removed and 152 snakes are also removed. And the ratio of spiders to snakes is now 18 to 13. And we are asked how many more spiders than snakes were in the pit at the start. Okay, now what I'm going to do is draw a, because we're doing a ratio here and usually you'll draw one bar for one and one bar for the other, which is exactly what I'm going to do. So spiders and snakes and this one is going to be 15 let's hope i actually have enough space for 15 i have not right so there we go so two four six eight ten twelve fourteen fifteen thank goodness for that there we go so here is my bar for spiders and for snakes, what have I got? Eight. Okay, so that's two, four, six, eight. There we go. All right, so this represents the first, um, the, the, the situation at the start. Okay, then we're told that 70% of the spiders are removed. Now, obviously it would have been nice and convenient had this been a bar of 10. So I have to think of how to divide this to make um, 10 parts. I mean, obviously 100 parts, but I, I only need 10 because it's 70%. Okay, so um, 15 divided by 10 is 1.5, one and a half. So one and a half parts is going to give me, if I divide this further, subdivide this, so every one and a half part becomes one of my new parts, then I'm going to get my 10 sections. I hope you're with me. So there we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So I now have 10 equal parts and what am I told? 70% of the spiders are removed. I'm going to do that from this end. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so my spiders, spider removal underway. Okay, so this is spiders. Now, um, Actually, I suppose I should say that's removed. Okay, now, because I have divided these, really what I should do, I want to maintain equal parts in my model. Um, what I'm going to do is divide everything. Okay, so these are... So I'm going to divide all of the original parts in two. Okay, so that I'm maintaining equal parts. Um, there we go. A bit boring to watch me do it, but there we go. Okay, just ignore the ones where I haven't gone over in pink. It's they're all the same. Okay, so we've got all of these equal parts. Okay. Right, now what are we told? We are told that 152 snakes are removed. Okay, well, I don't know. I, can't, I don't know enough to, to, to be able to manage that yet. Um, so I've done this bit. I can't do this bit just yet. But I am told that when after these snakes are removed, the ratio of spiders to snakes is now 18 to 13. Okay, so what do I have in spiders now? How many parts? Because I'm going to have, have 18. I need 18 parts of spiders. What have I got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, how convenient. Um, so what I'm going to do is further divide. Okay, I'm going to use... Yeah, another colour pen just to keep me straight here. So I'm going to further divide 
Okay, so each original part has now been divided into four. Okay, so each of the, there we go. I'm going to further divide this. Okay, okay, so I should have 18 parts here now. So let me just check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Hurrah. Okay, so this is the the end 18 parts. Okay, and for those 18 parts, I need 13 parts here. Yeah, so I also need to, these need to be equal parts, don't they? I could get I could do all of them, but I'm probably not going to bother. Um, so what do we need? Thirteen. So that's four, eight, twelve. Okay, we're just gonna do that bit there. Okay. So the at the end, all right, so the end situation I need thirteen parts. So I said that's twelve, that's thirteen, so that's up to here. Okay, so that's my 13 parts. Which means that what must have been removed is here. All right, these must be the snakes that were removed. And this is 152 snakes. Okay, so... What do I know? Well, I know that I ought to do what I keep saying I should do, and that is to divide all of the parts. Okay. There we go. So these parts are all equal now, and we have a value here. So what is that value? Well, let's see how many parts are here. So this is 4, 8, 12, 16, 17, 18, 19 parts. Okay, so that's 19 parts. All right, and we now have a, a value and a number of parts. So if I do 152 divided by 19, and I haven't got a calculator, so I'm going to have to cheat because I can't be bothered to do it. Um, Alexa, 152 divided by 19. 152 divided by 19 is 8. 8, fabulous. Okay, so that tells me that each of these parts has a value of 8. Okay, and I could um, draw them in if I wanted to. I don't need to. Right. Now, what's the question? How many more spiders than snakes were in the pit at the start? Okay, so what was our situation at the start? Well, this was these original bars. Okay, that was the original bar for the start. All right, there we go. So this is the difference between them. That's what I'm after. I suppose I should have drawn that in at the beginning. Um, how many more spiders than snakes were in the pit at the start? That's my question. Okay, well, I know what each of these is, um, each of these quarter parts, as it were, has a value of eight. All right. Um, how many parts is that? So that's one, two, or let's count it here. So let's one, one of the original parts, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Four times seven is 28. So there's 28 of these new quarter parts. So I need 28 times eight. Alexa, 28 times eight. 28 times eight is 224. Which gives me 224. And that is my final answer. 224 more spiders than snakes at the beginning.